let's go ahead and get the beard ready on this lovely day. As you can see here, this is what I typically wear my beard when I go to bed. I put a little butter in before there, I throw it in this bun, and then we try to get some sleep. So before we get going, let's get a couple of tools. Chicago Comb Model 8, the, the Chicago Comb Pick in some people, and I use this for my sides. This is just a boar bristle brush. And obviously we're gonna need some beard oil, and a lot of people are asking what is in this magical contract? It's water. It's just, it's just water, all right? So we're gonna need some products. This is what I have to choose for. As you can see here, big fan of the Copper Johns. We got the Cherry Grove Pier. We have the Harvest Moon, the Bourbon Bay. We got oils, we got butters, but they have these awesome cleansers and Ocean Mineral Moisturizer and this mineral wash. You guys should check it out. It makes my skin feel good. That's what I'm using, obviously, for my conditioner. And there's my soap back there. A couple of options. So, all right, let's, um, we'll just pick randomly this. All right, so let's get this going. So we take this out, obviously. Put this right on our fancy little wrist. The magical contraption. It's it's water. It, it's water. Give it a couple of sprays. My opinion, you never comb, whether it's your hair, don't have a lot up here, but your beard unless it is, uh, you know, wet because it can cause some damage and it just makes the whole process easier. So hit it a couple of times down each place. I'm going to brush. I like to get underneath as well because obviously we're going to brush underneath. So start with a pick. See, you got a little indentations and, you know, if you're still wearing a mask and everything like this, this pick is the magical tool to get rid of those. As you can see here, we just kind of hit this a little bit, every little direction, doesn't matter. What we're trying to do is just continually um, train the beard to go the way that we want. Train the hair to go the way that we want. You can already see the magic of this pick, all right? So before we get too far... I'm going to go ahead and get some beard oil. Randomly grab Salt City. Always shake your beard oil before you apply it. Don't need a lot, all right? A lot of people say, oh, you have a big beard. You must go through supplies and beard products all the time. A little bit of a dime-sized drop, maybe a quarter if you're feeling a little dry. Rub it together. Get it on the skin under the beard. Beard oil is not for the hair. Beard butter is for the hair, all right? So generously, just rub that in, all right? Then we're going to grab some beard butter, all right? See, this one gets used a lot. Don't need a lot. That way your phone's not greasy. Everything you touch isn't greasy. That's all I use. Again, rub it into the hand. Hit the sides. And the reason I do this is we want the product to then be combed in. We're going to take the Chicago comb. Now comb the butter through the hair. Look at this. Within just a couple of minutes, we have our beard looking fan fantastic you have an active job you um you know what i mean and you don't want your beard to kind of get everywhere i use this hair tie throw it in the half throw it in the bottom throw this in a braid whatever you want and on fridays we wear red, we wear red baby all right thanks for watching